A German company is offering Ukraine the benefit of being the first military to get its brand new tank. In February 2023, Rheinmetall revealed they are in talks with Ukraine to export the KF-51. Company CEO Armin Papager told the German business newspaper Handelsblatt that the Panther first delivery could be in 15 to 18 months, and suggests a factory in the country could be possible. We are talking to Kiev about exporting the Panther, Papager said. Rheinmetall presented the Panther at a Paris trade fair last summer and touted it as the strongest battle tank in the world, according to Handelsblatt. Rheinmetall believes a plant in Ukraine can be built for around 200 million euros, which could produce up to 400 Panther tanks annually. It would also need to be protected against air attack from the ongoing 2022 Russian invasion of Ukraine. Experts have questioned this plan for unrealistically high production rates, and insufficient investment for what is essentially still a concept weapon. The Panther KF-51 is a German main battle tank that is under development by Rheinmetall Landsystem. It was unveiled publicly at the Eurosatry Defense Exhibition on 13 June 2022. KF is short for Kettenfahrzeug, i.e., tracked vehicle. The KF-51 is based on the hull of the Leopard 2A4. A new turret is to be mounted on the Leopard 2, the main gun is an auto-loaded 130mm caliber. On 5 December, 2022 Rinmetal announced that it plans to mainly target existing Leopard 2 operators with the KF-51. The KF-51 is based on the hull of the Leopard 2A4, thus, it has a conventional layout for an MBT with the driver at the front, the fighting compartment turret in the middle, and the power pack at the rear. The driver is seated in the front right of the hull and is provided with a single-piece hatch above their position in the roof of the glacis plate. A separate crew station can be provided in the left front of the hull for either a dedicated systems operator or a unit commander. Color cameras for the driver are installed in the center of the front and rear of the hull. Should the KF-51 enter production a new hull would be designed by Rheinmetall. The Panther has a combat weight of 59 tons making it lighter than most Western MBTs developed prior to 2022. The power pack, tracks and most of the running gear of the vehicle are also believed to have been derived from those of the Leopard 2A4. This Leopard 2A4 power pack consists of an MTU MB873KA501 water-cooled V12 diesel engine producing 1,479 horsepower at 2,600 rpm. This coupled to a rank HSWL 354 four-speed automatic transmission. The Panther's maximum speed has not been disclosed, but it has a maximum range of 500 kilometers. The KF-51 Panther is stated to have three layers of protection, passive, reactive and active. The innermost layer consists of all welded steel armor covered by passive armor modules. The second layer comprises sensor-based reactive armor, while the final layer consists of Rinmetal's active defense system active protection system that Rinmetal claims is capable of protecting against kinetic energy projectiles and anti-tank guided missiles. It is possible to mount the ADS on both the hull and the turret. The primary armament of the KF-51 is a stabilized Rinmetal RH-130L, 51-130mm smoothbore gun that can be elevated from minus 9 degrees to plus 20 degrees. Rinmetal claims that this is capable of delivering between 18 to 20 megajoules, 13 million to 15 million foot-pounds force, of energy onto a target and that it has a 50% longer effective range than Rinmetal, 120mm tank guns. The RH-130 can fire armor-piercing fin-stabilized discarding sabo ammunition, programmable air-burst high-explosive and practice projectiles, 